Our gospel text of today is taken from the gospel of Luke chapter 10 verses 21 to 24 and speaks about the exclamation which Jesus gives. And the exclamation is an exclamation of joy and the joy is because the revelation that the father has made has been made to children. Children does not refer only to those who are young in age. Children refers to those who have the attitude of children as opposed to those who are intelligent and have the attitude of the self-righteous. So in other words, you might say that when Jesus uses the term children and thanks the Father for hiding these things from the learned and the wise. He doesn't really mean the learned and the wise in the ordinary sense of the word. He means those who imagine that they are wiser than everyone else. Those who imagine that they are more learned than everyone else. Those in a word who are self-righteous. As opposed to these, there are the children. They may be adults chronologically, they may be adults in age, but they are children because they have the attitude of a child. And while the attitude of a child can be spontaneity, it is primarily dependence. A child realizes that the child is dependent on its parents and so a childlike attitude besides many other beautiful qualities of children means in this context primarily where an individual realizes that he or she does not know everything, that he or she is willing to learn, that he or she is open and therefore dependent on the revelation that God makes. A self-righteous person will expect God to reveal himself as that person wants. A dependent or childlike person, on the other hand, will look for God to reveal himself and will find God in the revelation that God makes. So this is why Jesus thanks the Father for revealing himself not to these learned, wise and self-righteous who have their own agenda and want God to fit into their plans, but those who will fit into the plans of God. And Jesus then turns to the disciples and calls them blessed. He pronounces a beatitude on the disciples at the end of these verses when he says to them, Blessed or happy your eyes that see what you see. I tell you, many, many people long to see what you see and never saw it. And to hear what you hear and never saw it. What does he mean? He means that before him, people had never experienced him. They had experienced God as a God who was far away. They experienced God as a God who gave them commandments. They experienced God as a God of rules and regulations. They experienced God as a God to be placated and to be bought. Now Jesus says, I have revealed myself and I have revealed God to you as love and unconditional love. And this is why the disciples are blessed and this is why we are blessed. We need to keep in mind that our God is a God of love and wants to keep revealing himself to us. However, if we do not have the attitude of children and are self-righteous and expect God to reveal himself to us as we want, we will never find him. If, on the other hand, we realize our dependence on God, we realize our childlikeness that is within each one of us, God will reveal himself to us and we will find him in all things and all things in God. Are you one of those who is self-righteous and independent? If you are, will you attempt to become childlike and dependent?